Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In this uh, video, we will be covering the body cam footage of the arrest of Sean Paul Reyes at the 75th Precinct. Now, I've already covered this from his perspective uh, when he uh, brought it out a few weeks ago. But he just loves to show himself get arrested. And, well, uh, he doesn't exactly mind showing paperwork that doesn't exactly support his argument. And I don't mind uh, showing the paperwork and how it doesn't uh, support his argument to begin with. Which I will have the original video linked in the description box for you. And I'll have a few clips here later on. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. You can't record inside the building. Hey, how's it going? I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask you to step out. Can I'm I gonna ask you to step out. First, you're gonna have to step out. I have a wall right here. You want to go? All right, first, you're gonna have to step out for me. Please don't touch me. All right, then step out. Don't touch me. All right, so step out the facility. All right, so step out the facility. Sir, right now you're trespassing. Don't touch me. Right now you're trespassing. Hey, don't touch me. 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 Don't touch Get now off we can me. talk outside. Read the law that says right, I have the right to do it. Now we can talk outside. Now we can talk. Read the law. Right, now we, you wanted to talk. We can I'm talk. I'm going inside where I have the right to record. Inside. I do. Right, I have the right to record. Ah, right, you're trespassing. I'm not. I'm actually nope. leave and you refuse to leave. I'm not trespassing. Now you're not. Now you're not because you're outside. So no, I'm not trespassing in a building that I pay for either. So let's talk. Well, Sean. uh... Your contribution to this building uh, is probably about the same as everybody else combined. Maybe a few pennies. So uh, you might want to rethink that because you would be one out of millions of people uh, who actually pay for that building. So, uh, yeah, uh, your contributions would be minuscule. Something like a few pennies out of... Uh, well, millions of dollars collected by the tax by the government for taxes. So, yeah, not exactly a valid argument. And as far as that uh, pile of crap paper that you've got, uh, well, we'll just address that here in a moment. Whenever you bring it up again. So let's continue on. There was what no happened? reason. Why'd you put your hands on because me? Because I asked you to leave and you refused to leave. My paper is there. Devin right, doesn't I, mean you can I, put your hands your on me. Do closer, me a favor. Grab his paper. Let me speak to a supervisor. All right, All right no we, problem. We for you. Let me speak to a supervisor. All right, we got one for you. This is ridiculous. All right. You, it's ridiculous Stop that you're not, you're not following. You. I, think it's issue. I, just, I asked him to leave. You're with him? He refused to leave. Documenting. You're documented? Alright, just stop going closer to me. He has the law in his hands. That's fine. Are, are you, you scared of me or something? Nah, it's closer? in his hands. Are you scared of me? You keep coming closer. I keep telling you to back up. I'm, I'm going into my building. Pay for this building. Yeah, right. He has papers in his hands. Back, back up. You do pay for this building. Back up. Back up. You want to talk to a supervisor? Just we pay for from you. I'm waiting for the supervisor. Alright, so give him assistance. Alright, we'll get you your property. My property is inside this building right now. Huh? My property is inside this building. I'm asking my property. Yo, step back. Get it. Don't push him. What are you pushing me for? What are you pushing me for? No one's scared of me. 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 No tyrants and they didn't want you in their building and you kept on acting like this well after this incident you would never have been heard from ever again the very fact that you were allowed to post this video the very fact that you were able to get a hold of the body cam footage the very fact that you're still breathing proves that they are not tyrants. The very fact that you are not spending the rest of your life doing hard labor in a gulag in the middle of a wasteland proves that they're not tyrants. So get your act together, dude. My paper. All right, then where's your paper? I saw my paper. Right, it's inside. Paper? Where inside? It's inside. All right, where? All right, go inside. Me for, All right, yeah, what are you doing? Step away from me. What are you doing? Right, Don't touch me. Inside, what are you pushing on me for, man? All right, What's listen, wrong with you? All right, listen, if you come into the fully facility, no, you're going to be arrested for trespassing. For trust? I can't trespass yes. in a public I'll area. You say you can't be trespassed from public areas. Well, Sean, how many times have you been trespassed from 
public areas because I've lost count. I don't know the exact number, and nor do I care to know the exact number because, well, it's irrelevant because you would be proven wrong over and over again. Morning, sir. Like, give me my property. All right, I'm giving you my morning. property. All right, so step out, let go of the door. My property is right, inside so this building. All right, so let go of the door. My property is inside right, this so, building. All right, if you go to this door, I'm going to ask you. My property is inside this building. Grab me my property. All right, where's your property? Is it this? Hey, you shouldn't drop things. You guys are out of Have a good day, man. Coming Don't through those doors. Me. If he grabs those, alright, he's trespassing. He was right inside. Look you got look cuffs? Look you got look cuffs? Put your hands behind your back. Look at the look. 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 Alright, so put your hands behind your back. Alright, so put your hands behind your back. Yeah, Sean, we all know that you're not resisting. Uh, you don't have to act like a damn martyr. It doesn't really suit you because we all know that you're not because you're really pissing off Mahatma Gandhi. I'm not resisting. All right, good. I'm not resisting. All right. There you go. Read the floor, by the way. All right. What am I arrested for? Trespassing. I told you not to step into the police I'm facility. I'm not telling you resisting. I'm checking your pockets in case you have I'm anything. I'm sure that you don't sure. you know I'm not resisting. That's all. I'm not resisting at all. You were looking for this. I was looking for what? This, this interaction. I was looking for you to take away my freedom? Why would I want you to take away my freedom? You can't come in. Don't come in. No, dude, uh, they weren't looking to take away your freedom, but you were looking to uh, act like a martyr in front of your uh, audience so you could be a big bad man other than the pansy crybaby that you truly are. Why would I want you to take away my freedom for it? You mind just uh, getting the pedal? Yeah, I got you. I got you. Read the law. Oh, Sean, I read the law, and uh, well, what you posted up there wasn't exactly uh, supporting your position. So let me go back and uh, retrieve the clip and show you what uh, it's actually said. In a few minutes, I am probably going to be arrested by the NYPD, which is very unfortunate. Um, let's hope that that does not happen. So I want to speak to you guys. It's very important, right? Right here I have a law that was passed in the state of New York. I got it nicely laminated and everything for you guys. This law is a law that protects our civil rights. So we all know that we have a United States constitutionally protected right under the First Amendment of freedom of press. First of all, there is an argument out there as far as the establishment of the rationale behind not filming inside of a police department to begin with. For instance, the uh, protection of uh, victims' rights, because, you know, there are a lot of people that go into police departments to uh, seek help for uh, crimes that were committed against them, and... I'm sure that they don't want to be recorded by some idiot with a camera inside of the police department, which is a good reason why to ban them within the police departments themselves. Now, with that being said, all this uh, BS that's been going on as far as uh, the New York frauditors being arrested uh, has been taking place a lot around the police departments themselves, which means they're going in there intentionally trying to cause an issue, which of course they are because they're nothing but a bunch of drama queens to begin with. They want to cause as much drama as they can. Now, what I've been flashing across the screen the whole time has been uh, the uh, civil rights law that uh, Sean Paul Reyes has been talking about in his video. Now, while it does grant the average person the right to uh, film law enforcement officers in the course of their duties, it doesn't say anything about filming them inside of a police department, which is what this whole thing is about anyway. So the lack of any perspective as to where you can film the police is very interesting in this document, which definitely leaves it room for a lot of interpretation to begin with. So there's that part. Now, here comes the really interesting part that I need to bring up about this particular law. In paragraph two, it states, 
right to record law enforcement related activities. A person not under arrest or in the custody of law enforcement of it official has the right to record law enforcement activity and to maintain custody and control of that recording and any property or instruments used by that person to record law enforcement activities provided, however, that a person in custody or, well, let's just go ahead and stop right there and just focus on the first part of that uh, paragraph where it says a person not under arrest or in the custody of law enforcement official. So basically what it's saying here is that if you are under arrest, then you have given up your right to film the officers in the course of their duties. Now, there are plenty of reasons why these idiots get arrested, so therefore uh, they can't exactly film them while they're in the course of their duties. And you know what, Sean? I have watched enough of your videos to understand that it is not the filming issue that is the problem. It is your interference with their duties that becomes the problem. Because you have a nasty habit of trying to interfere and also going into the places where you are not exactly welcome anyway. So inevitably, you are asked to leave, then trespassed, and it escalates into you being arrested. So it's not exactly filming that's at the root of the problem. It's you and your frauditor friends that are most certainly at the root of the problem for acting like a bunch of jackasses. So in the end, this is not exactly a civil rights issue. This is just a issue of you... People not acting like normal human beings and acting like a bunch of damn fools. But let's go ahead and continue on with the video because I've rambled enough about this. You don't you like saw it, it, right? You don't like transparency. This is Look at this picture. Look at it. I mean, if uh, I were in this picture and my dad were to see me in handcuffs because I was acting like a jackass, well... He would pretty much disown me because he raised me better than that. I mean, he didn't raise me to be a bootlicker or anything like that. No, he taught me to question authority, but he didn't teach me to be an outright moron like you, Sean. For what? For what crime? No, for what crime? For trespassing. Not, not, not just trespassing. How does trespassing officer violate? How does it, how does it supersede? Not only my constitutional rights, but it supersedes New York State and New York City law. How does it do that? No one has their body cameras on? My body cameras on. Okay. Look, it's right here. So, so how does how does trespassing supersede I'm gonna do this New York State? I'm gonna do this first. I'm here. Alright, so I'm, I'm doing here. everything for Sean, uh that has to be one of the dumbest questions I've ever heard you ask. How does trespassing law supersede that of state law or even the Constitution? Well, uh, let me explain that to you right quick, Sean. First of all, uh, trespassing law is state law, you bloody moron. And how does it supersede the Constitution? Well, uh, let me give you the education on that because trespassing isn't exactly mentioned in the Constitution and uh, therefore the Tenth Amendment grants the states the rights to create laws that are not covered in the Constitution. How bloody stupid are you, Sean? I mean, any butter brain douche canoe moron such as yourself should be able to figure this crap out. I mean, damn, Sean, are you that freaking dense? I can speak, man. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna answer. You don't have to answer if you don't want to. You have the right to remain silent. Okay, so you're telling me that? Now, what counts is in front of you. Okay. Yeah. Do you want any medical attention? No, I don't need uh, medical attention. You mind? Attention. Uh, I don't have radio. You can you? Just I got. You. I got you. This is ridiculous. You know, this is 100% ridiculous. 
Oh, but baby. What reason? For what right, lawful but, reason? Answer that question. Would you do that? What lawful reason? Would you reason? go to a library and do that? Sir, so I came right? here with... You guys are right. law enforcement right. officers. I came here with a law. All right. I came here with right. a law. All right. To show you. And you don't want to see the law. None of you. Right, One, two, you three, three four, five, six right. different law forms. I have a right to record by New York State and New York City law. New York State and New York City law gives me the right to record. Yeah, but when they tell you and give you a law No, order, it doesn't. Stop. Read the law. It's laminated right there for you. All right. All right. It's okay. laminated right there for you. Read the law. I'll read you this law, sir. All right. It is a law in which intent to prevent a police officer from right, asking you. some information to knowingly impersonate the actual name and get a better address to the police officer. You know, at this point, Sean, I feel like that you're nothing more then a circus clown performing tricks for everybody. I mean, you're standing there taking this demeaning punishment. I mean, uh, you just got to have that attention. You don't, you don't care how much it makes you look bad. You just got to have the attention. You're a clown, dude. That's all you are. That's all you ever be, will be. There's absolutely no reason for any of this. Zero. <laughs> Zero reason for this. Um, what's your phone number? You don't need my phone number. It's a, it's a spot on your paper. You don't need it. You need my name, date of birth, address. So you refuse me to give a phone number. You have my you, you have I don't my have your phone number. That's what I'm asking. You refuse me to give You don't need it. That's, Is it a crime that's not, you not to that's give not me my number? That's not what I'm asking. I'm asking are you refusing me? Yes, I'm refusing to give you my phone number. You don't need it. All right, that's not what I asked. No one wants to read that nice laminated law, huh? Well, no one gonna, wants to read the law. It's a law. You are a law enforcement vouching. officer. We're going to be vouching for you, so we're going to read it. Don't you okay. are a law enforcement okay. officer, and you're going against New York City law. I'm counting money, money. okay? So we're gonna do you are reading you know you New York City law. You know that, right? You know how much you have? It's $1,000 in cash. I'm counting in front of you again, all right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. $1,000 in cash. Correct. 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 All right, you can buy me. All right. Oh boy, Sean, walking around with a thousand dollars in your pocket, uh, especially in New York City, that's not exactly the smartest thing to do, dude. Look at the law, Sergeant. Sergeant, look at the sir, law. Sir, are you hurt or injured? How are you going to cut your body? Sir, I don't know. I don't know if I'm injured. Do you need medical attention? No, I don't need medical attention. He said no. He said no already. Sergeant, look at the law. I'm trying to tell you that there is a law. Right, I don't need a. What, look what, at what am I being? For, I'm arrest, being arrested what for trespass or something. Uh, 1120. I want you to look at the law because it's very important. You are a law enforcement officer, Sergeant. You should really look at the law. There's a New York State law and a New York City law that grant me the right to record the police in the course of their duties. There's no exception for a police lobby, oh, Sergeant. Sergeant did, Lopez, did, there's did no answer, exception. Did you answer my question earlier? Would you call something after they tell you to leave from a library? But would you have you no right talking? to tell me to leave. Would you, would you keep talking and you have no everybody right. that's in the lobby? You have, the have no library. right to tell me to leave a public right. place. I'm trying, to give, I'm trying to give you an example. You're not trying no, to but you have no right to tell me yeah, to leave a public place. I don't need place. to talk to you anymore. You There's a law. You don't, you don't, it's good, right? you don't have to talk to me, Sergeant. You have the right to... You know, I've had enough of this damn ass clown for one day, uh, so I'm just going to end the video right here because it's more of the same once they get into the back room. I mean, his argument doesn't change. He just acts like a complete clown, a buffoon, or whatever the hell you want to call him, and he just doesn't want to give up the argument at all, even though nothing supports it. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the, my take on this video, and I will see you on the next one.